you guys, it's Morgan and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a birthday haul for you guys because I recently turned 13. I'm going to show you everything that I got for my birthday and not all of this was gifted to me. I did use some of my birthday money to purchase some of these gifts and I'm not trying to brag in any way, shape, or form about what I got. I'm simply showing you guys and sharing with you guys what I got for my birthday. So yeah, let's get started. So I'm going to start with Bath & Body Works and now I think for about two years I've been going back to Bath & Body Works and getting another like fall scent for the fall. So this year I went back and I got the fall scent, there it is, Champagne Apple and Honey. This is such a really, really, really good smelling scent and normally I don't go for honey things but this smells really good because it smells like an apple orchard, like it smells like an apple pie and I love how this smells. Um, and then I got it in a lotion form for, you know, after I get out of the shower. And then I got it in a perfume form because I always need a nice smelling perfume. And I spray this around my room too, so my room smells like me, I guess. And then I got a candle. On the front it says all you need is fall, but then on the bottom it says flannel. So I don't know if it's called flannel or all you need is fall, but it smells really good and it's something that normally I wouldn't go for because it's not like super perfumey and like super sweet smelling but this does smell really good. And then I got a hand sanitizer called Beautiful Day and when I get hand sanitizers I like getting hand sanitizers that I can use throughout the school year. And while we're on the subject of bath things from my parents I got the Philosophy Happy Birthday Soap Set. And the soap is, I think it's like vanilla, it's like vanilla cake batter uh, scented. And then the uh, lotion is sweet creamy vanilla frosting, which smells so good. I actually already used these as you can tell, but I put them back in the box for this video. Um, but these smell so good. If you guys are looking for a good birthday gift to ask for, definitely ask for this. It smells amazing. Like, Oh, amazing, I can't rave enough about it. Okay, I'm weird. All right, that's sexy. <laughs> so while we're on the subject of, you know, bath and body stuff, I went to bath time in Cave May, and if you guys saw my other video, self promo, um, I went to the store while I was in Cave May, and they had some really cool stuff. So I got, which I think is the most exciting thing I've ever bought in my entire life. I almost didn't buy them because they were $40. I was like, whoa, I'm not spending $40 on those, but then I kind of stopped thinking about them because they were just, Amazing, so I bought them. And I bought these slippers. I know, I know. They are the cutest things ever because they're like this mauve color. It kind of matches my backpack for school. Uh, I haven't seen what's in my backpack video. You click the card too. Um, but anyway, they have like pearls and diamonds in the center and it's in a bow. So obviously I had to buy them and I've used them already and they're the most comfortable things I've ever worn in my entire life. And then the next thing, they have this thing called soap by the slice which I've never heard of that before, but it's like a big bar of soap and they just slice it for you. It's just really cool. So I got a piece of soap and this is like a cupcake. I know. So this literally smells like a bakery. Like it doesn't just smell like cupcake. It smells like an entire bakery full of delicious sweets and scents and I just had to get it because it smells so good. I can smell through wrapping paper. It smells really good. Yeah. Okay, so this I actually did buy with my birthday money and I went to Hollister. The first thing I got were these really cool like army green like jogger style pants and I really really like these because you can dress them up and you can dress them down and I'm having an obsession with army green as you can tell. So yeah, this feeds my obsession for army green. <laughs> and the next thing I got at Hollister were just a pair of jeans because I just needed a new pair of jeans. The next thing I got was a black t-shirt. I know, but I got this black t-shirt and it has a little tie in the front because I like shirts with ties in the front, but the thing is I can never figure out how to tie my shirts. So this just came pre-tied. Okay, so the next present is actually something my grandmother got me and she's been getting me these, like the specific gifts for like two years now. So she got me an Alex and Ani bracelet and it says you are my sunshine and that's like really sweet because she always sings that song to me you are my sunshine my only sunshine so I thought that was really cute and oh I got these flowers from my grandfather who lives in California my mom's dad uh, and then I got these two little teddy bears aren't they cute and they came with food who doesn't love food okay the next thing I got was also from my grandmother and it's an ER plush <laughs> I know, I'm four years old. But I actually saw Christopher Robin, like the movie with my grandmother and my grandfather, 
And I really love it, and I told her that Eeyore was my favorite character, and she got me a little Eeyore plush. So the next thing I bought was my birthday money. Um, I got from Garage, and as fall is coming up, it's gonna get colder, but I only have like short sleeve shirts and like tank tops that I really wear, so I got this like maroon hoodie, and they have these cool stripes on them. It kind of reminded me of a Letterman's jacket almost. It's mainly why I bought it, and it kind of reminded me of Riverdale. So I'm gonna go over here, and the first thing I got from my parents was this black Adidas drawstring bag, and I wanted one of these because I do dance at school, and I wanted a bag that I could keep my dance stuff in that's not super big, and something I can maybe even fit in my backpack so I don't have to carry on two big bags because I do take public transportation to and from dance and to and from home. The next thing I got, which I actually spent my birthday money on, I always go into this little tea store in Cape May, New Jersey, and I got some tea, and they always have like, 12 for five dollars I think so it was a really cute store and they had this really cute china set it's adorable so I got herbal do you say herbal or herbal some people say herbal I don't know why I got herbal Christmas tea because I love Christmas I got chamomile and fruit tea I got another Christmas tea cranberry orange white pomegranate white orange with clove I've never tried this one before but it'll be interesting lemon mango Perry, Perry, red raspberry, white peach, and English breakfast. Oh, no, that wasn't supposed to happen. I'm mainly excited to try this Paris tea because it's supposed to be fruity black tea with bergamot oil. Don't know what that is. I'm not that fancy, but I'm excited to try it. <laughs> All right, so the next thing I got was a blue duffel bag with a dolphin on it. No, I'm just kidding. There's something inside of it. So I always have this struggle where my legs get colder than my arms do. So I thought, why not be fun about it and get a mermaid tail blanket, you know? It looks like a mermaid. It's like a mermaid tail. I'll put in some B-roll of me wearing it. But it's a mermaid tail and it goes on your legs and it's the best gift I've ever gotten. All right, so the next thing I actually bought with my birthday money and I went to Brandy Melville. And Brandy Melville has the most nonchalant bags, may I add like no branding, it's just like a black bag. So the first thing I got from Brandy Melville was this really, really pretty white top. And it's kind of cropped, it's kind of not, but it goes on the shoulders, so it goes like this. And it's really, really pretty. I don't know what I'm gonna wear this to, but I'm gonna find an occasion for it. That's what I told my mom when I bought this. I was like, I don't know what I'm gonna use this for, but I'm gonna find something because it's too cute not to buy. The next thing I got was a black denim skirt, and I actually don't own any denim skirts, so this is a different change of pace for me because I typically don't like denim skirts, but this one is super cute because it's black and it's distressed, so I decided to give it a try. I also got this periwinkle t-shirt, and I don't own any t-shirts of this color. I have a black t-shirt and a red t-shirt, I think, so I want to switch it up with periwinkle. Next thing, I got a Newport sweatshirt because I needed something really like comf and really like super awesome for the fall. So I got this and it kind of reminds me of a Gap sweatshirt. Just a little, maybe, maybe not, I don't know. Okay, so the next gift is actually from my mom and dad and they got me this t-shirt. It says limited 2005 teenager edition. And then on the back, get ready for it. It has my name and the number 13 on it. And the next thing they got me was this bracelet with all these charms on it, it's super cute. And it has my initials on it, it says 13, it has my birthstone on it. Like, aren't they cool, aren't they cool? I think it's the greatest. And the next thing I got for my mom and my dad was, not a laptop because I got this laptop for Christmas the year before I started YouTube, before. but I got a laptop case because my other one had a bunch of sticker stains on it and I was not about to walk around with my laptop looking all cattywampus like that. So. I got a marble one and it's really cute. I like it a lot. So the next thing I got, which is also under my blanket, is this 2019 planner from one of my best friends. And she actually came on my Cape May trip with me. Her name's Nora. You guys probably know her from my Instagram lives. But she got me this really cute planner and I love pink and I love planning. So this is like the perfect gift. It's full of my plans. Shh. And the next thing I got, which is also from my friend Nora, was this Philosophy Soaps in Paradise Girl. And this smells like pineapple and like coconut. Yeah, it smells like pineapple and coconut and like kiwi. It smells really, really good. The next thing I got, which was also from Nora, was a Burt's Bees grapefruit candle. And this smells like a grapefruit. That was really unnecessary. It smells so good. 
and I totally recommend this candle. Okay, so the next thing I've got was from my uncle and my aunt. They got me Nike shoes, but not just any Nike shoes, okay? Wait for it. I guess my dad told me these are like retro Nike shoes. I don't know anything about sneakers. I'm sure the guys in my school will tell me that what these sneakers are, but they got me these retro Nike shoes. They're so cute, right? Like they're gray. Uh, they're like high tops, which I do like high tops, so that's good. Uh, but you haven't even seen the best part yet, ready? On the back is my initials. I know, I know. Isn't this the cutest thing ever? And my initials in gold, and I love these so much. So thank you, Uncle Matt and Aunt Heather. The next thing I got, which I bought with my birthday money, I got a new concealer, or concealer. This concealer is an ours concealer. I've never had this concealer before, but I needed a darker shade because I am a little more tan, even though I probably look the same to you guys, but I got tan, uh, so I need a darker shade. And they also gave me a few samples. Uh, they gave me a sample of the Fenty Beauty Primer and the Lycome Foundation. And last, but certainly not the least, I went to Lush. I got two things from Lush. I got this face mask, it's called Don't Look At Me, and it's a cleansing lemon juice and scrubby ground rice Leave Complexions Glowing Face Mask. And I have to admit, at first I didn't really like the smell, but it's kind of growing on me. It kind of has almost like a lemony, blueberry, ricey smell, if that makes any sense. And then I got a lip scrub because I had an old one and it was bubble gum, but it was expired and it was super hard and I couldn't even get lip scrub out of it. So I just got a honey lip scrub because I really like putting lip scrubs on before I put my lip balm on because it makes my lips super soft afterwards. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and comment down below what one of your all-time favorite birthday presents are. And if you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe so you can see more of my videos because I would love for you to be part of my YouTube family. And I think that's everything, and I'll see you guys next time.